Serge Devoki is an absolutely inspirational scientist. He's been going out to Cooper Island since he was in his early 20s. And every summer, he measures all the birds and weighs them and, and does all sorts of testing on the black guillemots. Guillemots are a very charismatic bird, and uh, luckily they are a... Uh, fun species to look at. I often wonder if someone who studies sea cucumbers or some sort of invertebrate, if they could study them for 33 years. There's a whole climate change story about how we live out there. We used to have trouble putting our tent stakes in when we first got out there because the permafrost was so close to the, to the surface and the active layer really hadn't melted yet. We would then dig a hole to put our uh, yogurt and cheese in. And in 2003, I went out there and started digging my frost cellar. Didn't hit any frost. Didn't hit any permafrost, got through and hit water. And, and in terms of those eureka moments, I mean, you know, you can plot data for 30 years and say that the climate is changing. You can also dig a hole in a place that you know was frozen for the past 30 years and hit water. And it's something that clicks in your head. In the next five years, we're going to have a complete loss of summer pack ice, apparently. And it well could take place this summer since we are in unknown territory in terms of ice melt. If this is the last summer of summer ice, all the animals that have always expected the ice to be there, like seals and polar bears, fish and various seabirds, will have major problems and this will be kind of an unprecedented loss of, a, of an ecosystem.